I'm Graham Sells. I'm a pharmacologist from the University of Liverpool. And my role in the AFPGX project is to lead one of the work packages that was specifically focused on response to the first drug in people with a new diagnosis of epilepsy. Because we know that, that while well, a large number of people with a new diagnosis of epilepsy will do respond very well to their first medication, a significant proportion of those people will not do so well. And it would be very interesting for us if we could develop a test that would allow us to predict who would do well and who would uh, do not so well. So some of the work we've been doing is looking at people who become seizure free with their first drug compared to some of the people who don't have a remission and have to change their medication, perhaps for another drug or have to have a second drug in. And we're looking at the genetics, the uh, genetic differences between those two groups of people to try to understand if there's a test we might do right at the start that will help us predict who follows which path. I think it's, yeah, although we're at a very early stage, I think we've got some encouraging genetic signals from the work. I think that in the future, we may well be able to identify people who do well with the first medication. And I think that other projects like FPGX uh, can really help us to understand and pick the right drug for each patient with epilepsy so that people have the best possible chance of becoming seizure-free very early in the course of the disorder.